Hey my friends, it's time for another recipe on Real Nice Guyana. It's Molly and Real Nice here. Today we'll be making a fish choker which goes mainly with dal and rice. But of course you can have this any which way you like. And we're going to be using two mango mary here for the choker. And the items on the left there, the scallions, this here, we'll be using for seasoning the fish. And the seasonings on the right there, we are actually going to be using for the choka in itself. We are also going to be using some salt and some black pepper. And that's all there is here. So on the left here we have one stem of scallion, a quarter of an onion, one clove of garlic, one broad leaf thyme or pudina, and one weary weary pepper. So the peppers in this dish is of course optional as always. So let's get started with this Bangamiri fish choker my friends. So first of all you're gonna debone your Bangamiri or whatever fish you're using. So we are using these bangamaries here. You can of course get the fillet. I use a fillet instead of the entire fish. And you wanna have to do deboning and stuff like that. So after washing you're gonna place these on paper towels to get it dry. So she's gonna crush the garlic for the seasoning here now. To season the fish with. Broad leaf time. Okay guys, so that's the seasonings that which Molly started to grind and I completed. So that's gonna be to season the fish. So Molly is going to go season the fish now, so first you have to dry it off, if you have to use extra paper towels, please do. Because you want this to be as dry as possible. So she's adding the salt there for us to begin with. Now the black pepper. So how long ahead can you season this, Molly? For 15 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes. So do you season this for overnight and stuff like that? Yes, you could season it overnight. But we're not gonna do that, of course. And we're gonna be making a choker right away. So our fish is seasoned there now, so Molly's gonna chop the other remaining seasonings here for mixing the choker. Okay, so we've got everything ready here, my friend. So we have some flour there, which we have seasoned with a bit of salt and some black pepper. So we're gonna go fry the fish now. So we have some vegetable oil, which is already hot. And the pan we are using is not that big. So we'll be frying one of these fillets at a time. If you have a bigger pan, you can fry both, or how many you have that can fit into your pan. 
So you're going to flour both sides of the fillet. pieces there. So as long as your oil is hot, this doesn't take very long to fry. So these doesn't take very long to fry my friends as long as your oil is hot. So about a minute now Molly's gonna flip this. That's looking good my friends. Maybe I'll just forget about the choker and have these right now. As soon as this is done here. What do you say? So that's after another minute. So our last piece of fish is done here, my friend. So of course you want to place these on paper towels so it soaks up most of the oil before you use them. Looks nice to go with some bread. Yeah, some bread and some nice pepper sauce and a bottle of cold drinks. Well, we promised to make choker, right? So we gotta go ahead with the choker. So it's time to break up the fish here now for the choker. So if you see any bones in there, you can just fish them out. So you'll break this all up. So the fish is all broken up there my friends. Molly went in with two forks and broke up the rest. And uh, she fished out whatever bones she could there. So now it's time for the mixing. So she's going to add the salt there. And you're gonna mix in everything well. And that's about it. That's your fish choker to go with your dal and rice. That was easy, wasn't it? So here is our final product, my friends. Our Mangameri fish choker. 
course especially with dal and rice and you can of course use whatever fish you prefer to make this choka with but this banga mary here is the most commonly used fish for this choka so if you like this recipe guys please give it a thumbs up please subscribe please share this video also and as always thanks for watching take care bye